Hello, this is Lance Johns. Um, I'm I'm gonna talk about the Bellagio being bought by, I guess, Blackstone Group. The MGM uh is is trying to uh sell the Bellagio for like four million. Well, they're in the process of selling the Bellagio for. for for four million or more than four million that what the article says. Um Las Vegas based MGM announced Tuesday that it will reach a deal with New York Finance Group, the Black Stone the Blackstone Group that calls for the joint venture to acquire the Bellagio real estate and lease it back to MGM for for an annual rent of two forty Two forty five million, so I guess they're going to um I guess uh rent it to the DMG for forty for forty five million I guess a year. MGM will receive a five percent ownership stake at the joint venture around four point two billion in cash. The company said the deal is expected to close this quarter. Blackstone led by millionaire Stephen Sw- Swartz Swartzman has been on a real estate buying spree in Las Vegas for years, and purchase of Villaggio makes it makes it the landlord or a high profile resort that that one of the MGM biggest money makers on the strip. MGM announced a deal and managed to say it is selling the Circus Circus for eight hundred twenty five million to Treasure out on the field, roughing. Collect- collectively, MGM said that two transactions would would let it build a fortress, balance sheet, and return capital and shareholders. But they said no changes expected. The Bellagio features more than 3,900 rooms and 155,000 square feet of casino space and sits on 77 acres of land. According to security file, violence draws plenty of tourists to its doors. <clears throat> and hold on. And the fountain show, and and it has the fountain show that indoor floor displays. M. Jim spoke to Deborah Deshawn said there will be no changes for. To the Bellagio operation from the deal, I guess the, the MGM will operate the, the resort as we do for other profits that has been sold to real estate trusts. She said in an email, "Guests and employees should see no difference in their ex- experiences as a result of the transaction." MGM chairman CEO Jim Merce had a phone interview that the deal unlocks trend, tremendous amount of unvalued real estate in our portfolio. Why would they sell it and then rent it? That's stupid. They shouldn't sell it at all. Uh, that's weird. MGM Chairman CEO Jim Murray and Foam Inview. Oh, I read it already. Never mind. Combined with the circus circus sale, MGM can reduce debt and rebuild capital to a higher return investment, such as the pursuit of a project in Japan, sporting bet, betting, and non gaming entertainment. He said, and the company is moving towards a more nimble, asset high operation. Under the deal, MGM had a third-year lease for a two-year extension operation, Murray said. The sale was no surprise. Bloomberg's report last month that MGM was an advanced talk to sell the Bellagio MGM Grand to Blackstone and then leased them back. So I guess, I don't know if they're going to try to buy them back, but uh, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know what they're trying to do. D- those resorts were the top two generations of operating income among the MGM Las Vegas properties. Last year, pumped out nearly 710 million combined as security filing shows. Murray declined to comment on whether it talks with Blackstone include the MGM Grand. Blackstone said in a new release Tuesday that MGM Resorts will continue to operate Bellagio and be responsible for all aspects of the property to on a day-to-day basis. 
including capital ex as oh, ex expenditures. Black operating president and chief operator John oh, Gray man. said in a statement in part that the company officials are big believers in MGM Resorts in Las Vegas. Over the past several, several years in Southern Nevada, Blackstone has acquired cheap homes in bulk to turn the rentals to 68 acre huge center office park for $347 million to Cosmo, Las Vegas for more than $1.7 billion and downtown 5.4 square foot world market center furniture showroom hall for an unclosed sum. It has also spent hundreds of millions of dollars by local apartment complexes. So, um, so I guess uh, they're going to rent lease back to Bellagio. I don't know if it, I don't I don't know if they're, if they're leasing back to own it or if they're going to just lease it. I don't know. But I don't know. That's that's weird. But that's what they're going to do to the Bellagio. I don't know if they still go consider it was your profit. I mean um I think they should did the other places like that they, they go lease them back. I don't know, but that's that and like share subscribe. Thank you for listening. Goodbye, have a good day.